So round five of the Grand Prix season, we're just outside the circuit de Catalunya, the traditional start of the European season. So we thought we'd do a big time track guide. We've got the smiling assassin from Red Bull who's going to help us, Daniel Ricciardo. Good day, mate. How are you? Good on you? Good stuff. And we have our own track guide helicopter behind us. That's a bit tight, isn't it? It's not pretty, but we made it. That's it. Okay. So we have uh, World Championship V8 Formula One and we're going to try and keep up with him, the helicopter. We know that's going to be very difficult to do as he blasts out onto the start-finish straight. Just talk us what, what he'll be thinking or experiencing in the cockpit right now. Turn one and two, it's, it's really, you're just preparing for turn three. You know, turn three is a long, fast right-hand corner. Um, it's just a lift, you know, maybe on new tyres it could be full throttle and uh, that's where you make up a lot of time. So then you, you come into turn four, which is, it's similar in a way, but just a, a bit of a tighter radius. And then coming into five and normally into fourth gear, brake, hug the apex, and then let the car run out. Um, it, it's quite hard on the tires. You wanna make sure you uh, don't slide too much early in the lap. Then up through turn seven, it's really cool. Gonna look to use a lot of the exit curb. And you can, you can actually see the car start to skate around and, and that's basically getting sucked into the camber. And then as you come out of the camber, the rear gets light into the, uh, the other really fast right-hander, turn nine, which is just a lift in probably, yeah, sixth or seventh gear. Uh, a fun corner where you can really push the car to the limit. One of the tightest corners on the track, turn 10, good place for overtaking. It is also quite physically hard on the back of the driver's neck. Now you're a finely tuned athlete, so you probably don't notice it so much. You definitely brace yourself when you brake and, and you try and hold your neck, you know, back against the headrest rather than, you know, let it fly forward. It's a, a good, good challenge for us and a very good passing opportunity. 12's like a double apex. You see him get quite loose on the rear there. And yeah, trying to put the power down out of the last chicane is tricky because the tire temps are hot. You know, you, you've overheated a bit and, uh, just got to try and remain full for the last corner here. Get a good run down this long straight. And uh, you'll see him get a bit of a slide out of the last corner. And he disappears again, approaching 200 miles an hour down into turn one. You can start to have the dream now of the commentator's voices, as they say. And coming out of the last corner on the final lap. Last time Daniel Ricciardo coming to win yet another Grand Prix. Since I was even racing in junior categories, I always like to uh, flex a bit. Muscles, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah. So if I get some more wins, you'll see you'll see yeah. me flex. And it's got everything to it, you know, high speed, low speed, some good up and down sort of elevations. I think the track is a good one. It's, it's a different G for trying to do in a helicopter. You can see you cannot keep up with the corner. I can't even set up. <laughs> yeah, I'm not exaggerating. I do feel that. Well, I hope we haven't yeah. upset your program for the weekend then. I'll still win. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. We'll see that smiling face up there on the top spot. Be nice. Yeah. Barcelona, here we come. Hopefully you got good flow this weekend and bring home some bacon. Thanks for being my wingman. Cheers. No worries, Iceman. What were you again? And that's you not, were that's not Kimmy. That's not Kimmy. That's Goose. 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 Are you sure you want to be Goose? I don't know. Iceman sounds <laughs> cooler. So you're the smiling assassin. You're yeah. in character. I'm, I'm Kimmy. Okay. Go. Hey, how are you? Cool. Cool. Um, dinner at seven, yeah? Sweet. Can you pick me up? All right, thanks, man. Good chat. <laughs>